Hey Pisces, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to row. My name is Kianti and I'm going to bring us a reading. Again, this is going to be for the sign of Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are cross-watching for a Pisces, it will resonate from your perspective. It is energy, so every message won't resonate for every baby shark on the planet. But if I get it right for you, my beautiful Pisces, make sure you give me the like, comment, subscribe, and the share. And if you're interested in booking me for it, a private reading my email information is offered in the description box below pisces we're going to do this together but this is the incoming energies this is what we don't see and this is the outcome about whatever situation that we have going on here pisces i haven't looked we're going to do it together but i do see certain things and we're going to discuss i have the fledgling i have the nine of gabriel which is the nine of pentacles i have the four of pentacles i have the family room and i have the fox and Pisces, I sat here and I meditated. I'm like, what the hell is this about? What 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 is this about? Because I couldn't make heads or tails of it. I thought I knew what was happening with the fledgling and the nine of pentacles. It feels like getting something off the ground, right? A whole new beginning. A single, solid, stable abundant a, a beginning, right? The, the nine of Gabriel is the nine of pentacles. I'm sorry, this is the nine of wands, actually. Ew. Stay determined and move forward. Be prepared for any, possibi any possibility environmental activism okay it feels to me pisces what i what i was thinking when i was meditating on this was it felt like sitting up in my room the, the brandy version but in the living room pisces someone is trying to either figure out how to start some sort of business here some of you are trying to figure out how to start a business a work from home business you're strategizing about this I have somebody strategizing about new furniture or redecorating I also have somebody is sleeping on the couch. <laughs> someone is <laughs> someone is sleeping on the couch, Pisces. I don't know who that's for. Put it where it goes, but someone is sleeping on the couch. There's an energy of sitting up in my living room here, right? It, there's definitely an energy of um. I feel like there's a lot of strategy about how to get some sort of new start here for sure. Some of you are, like I said, some of you could be, there, there could be energy of saving money because you want to redecorate or change some things here. Or some of you are strategizing about a new business or something here, getting something new off the ground. But it's something that's going on in your home, in the living room, Pisces. Put it where it goes because it's going to be different things for each and every one of you. Let's see what we have for the incoming energy here, Pisces. Let's see. The warrior could be dealing with... <laughs> <laughs> this is typically a Scorpio card for me, but it is a masculine energy for sure for me, the warrior energy. Let's see what's going on here, Pisces. Male Pisces, put yourself where you go, feminine. Divine guidance. The search for the meaning of life. Consider an alternative approach. Surround yourself with wise teachers or friends. Okay, so this is the Hierophant. Okay, see, some of you are trying to figure out something about work or career. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Scorpio. Mm. Okay, let me see what I got going on here for this incoming energy, Pisces, the Knight of Cups. <laughs> Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Emperor. Some of you are definitely dealing with a Taurus or an Aries or a Scorpio. Hmm. Imprisonment and the Lilies. Well, there we have it. Pisces. The incoming energies here. Like I said, some of you are definitely interested in being your own boss or working for yourself or going on your own path. Pisces, some of you are definitely trying to figure out how you can go take go. Um, it kind of feels like, yeah, kind of like be your be your own boss or, or run your own show here. You're fighting to do something your way to have some sort of opportunity to get out of some sort of energy where you feel stuck. Pisces, for some of you, I see a man here. <laughs> Oh, man, a whole man. <laughs> this man here is getting ready to make some sort of, take some sort of action here. Imprisonment and a warrior. This man could literally be behind bars. Literally, Pisces, but he doesn't have to be. There's an... There's a man here, Pisces, for some of you. There's getting ready to put up some sort of battle to get himself unstuck. The warrior and imprisonment. I'm telling you, he is, Pisces. Male Pisces, if you're watching this, this could be you. You could be like me. F yes. I'm yes. I'm the emperor. I'm taking control. I'm getting ready to fight this good fight. I told you someone is uh it's considering an alternative approach here. Someone could definitely want a new opportunity and want to start over with you. Someone could want a fresh start with you. They could be stuck in their head here, Pisces. Just put this where this goes. There's a man here for sure, though. 
if you're Pisces, if you're feminine energy watching this and you're not dealing with the man, I feel like as far as work or career, you're definitely looking to go in, a, in, in your own direction. I feel like you're getting ready to stand your ground. You want to do something where you're kind of working for yourself or your own, you're your own boss. And you could definitely be seeking out guidance. You could be talking to te to teachers. You could be some some of you are definitely talking to a teacher or something like that about something here. There could be masculine Pisces. If you're watching this, if you're the man watching this, I see you taking action. I see you getting ready to put up to stand your ground, get yourself out of some sort of jam, take control of something. If you're a woman watching this feminine Pisces, you could there could definitely be a man that's that's literally you could literally be in an energy right now, to fighting a good fight to get himself up out of some sort of situation here. This man could be coming directly towards you here, Pisces. Just put yourself where you go in the scenario. Let's get some energy on this. Clarify the incoming energies for the baby sharks for this. Let's read. Someone is definitely sitting up in that living room strategizing the two of wands. That doesn't help a lot. This is just someone making a decision. <laughs> the magician. You could be dealing <laughs> with the Virgo or a Gemini. I do feel like there's a master. Eight of cups. I'm telling you. What did I tell you? It feels very masculine. Pisces, if you are not in this energy of like really taking control of your own situation, running your own show, doing some shit your way, no longer being stuck and tied down or imprisoned by some sort of belief system or some sort or, or whatever this is that you you're getting away from and you're trying to you're going your own way to work for yourself you could be manifesting this for yourself and you're getting ready to do this eight of cups walk away from people places and things that's no longer serving you possibly even a career or an employer for others of you there's a man here i just have to say it there's a man that's getting ready to take some sort of action this this magician is manifesting because the, this guy here is going to get himself out of some sort of jam. I just called the energy. The moon is here. You could be dealing with another water sign. Very mysterious, mysterious shit here, Pisces. <laughs> Give me some more on this incoming energies. For the Pisces. Give me more on the incoming energies. Give me more on this for Pisces. The magician again. Well, thank you. There that person is again. The eight of cups. There it is again. Well, thank you. The moon. I guess I'm going to stop asking here, Pisces. You may definitely be cooking up something. Pisces, if you're doing this, you are cooking up something. You're manifesting something in secret. Some of you are definitely, I don't know what you're doing in secret here. Tarot readers, psychic spiritualists. I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> you're doing something. But others of you, this is, this is a man doing this. You don't see this coming with the moon. Very mysterious shit. Yeah, but there's somebody playing in here. You could definitely be dealing with another water sign for sure. Let's see what we don't see here. Let's see what the baby sharks don't see because, wow. Strength. You could be dealing with the Leo. Perseverance. Let's see. The three of Raphael, which is the three of cups. Reasons to celebrate a community of friends. Happy announcements regarding relationships or children. Oh, okay. Well, let's see what else we got here. Some of you reuniting with a Leo. Five of Wands. There's conflict. Uh-oh. I'm getting some conflict. The high priest is Pisces. You better use your intuition here. Because here you are. Here you are. Here's the Three of Cups. But there, here's the Five of Wands. There's, there's some conflict here. Some of you could be dealing with the fire sign, another water sign. What else do we got here for what you don't see? Message. <laughs> Pisces, some of you don't see a message because you have someone blocked. I have to tell you. Some of you, someone has been trying to communicate with you, but you have them blocked. That's why you don't see the message. Some of you don't see an incoming message from somebody, but there is. Someone is conflicted internally with sending a message to you. They want to reunite here. <laughs> the mice and the sickle. Oh, oh. For some of you and what you don't see, there's some sort of breakup here and it's going down bad. The mice and the sickle. This is somebody breaking up or getting away from users, takers, people, people who take people for granted, right? Mm. Listen, I got to tell you, some of you, someone can want to communicate with you. They want to communicate with you a message. You don't see this about a conflict. It could be a conflict. I feel like this feels like... There's some sort of conflict. This is probably involving multiple people, Pisces. You'll have to put it where it goes. You're the high priestess here. 
So either you're not saying shit or your intuition is telling you something in this situation. I feel like your intuition could tell you that some, could be telling you that someone wants to tell you something here about a conflict. I feel like there's a lot of people involved in something here, Pisces, and there's some sort of message that either hasn't gotten through or it or is getting ready to come through about a severance and an ending with this kind of energy. The mice is definitely like users, you know. Being taken for granted, right? The sickle is severing a cycle of that, right? And what you don't see, Pisces, is either someone wants to communicate with you. Someone could want to reunite with you and they could want to communicate and tell you all about that energy, right? For sure. Pisces, some of you are like are not speaking, not like you're not speaking to somebody, and, and there, there is like you could have somebody blocked, but they want to communicate with you. That could be causing them a lot of conflict. I just see conflict, I see conflict, I see multiple parties being involved, and I see a severance of energy of takers here, Pisces. And this isn't what you don't see, but your intuition is telling you something here because you're coming up as the high priestess. You could definitely be dealing with a Leo or a fire sign. Here. Let's get some more energies on what we don't see for the baby sharks. Give me some on what we don't see here. Yeah, some of you, someone wants to reach out to you so bad and tell you something. They're, they're holding themselves back, but it has something to do with them possibly severing themselves from this kind of energy. Or you severed with them because you saw them that way or some shit like that. I feel like somebody's trying to hold back from saying something. And it's in what you don't see. Pisces, let's get some energy on this. The baby sharks. The fool, you could be dealing with an Aries. The two of cups. Yeah, there is there is some sort of energy. Someone could definitely be... I don't know why I just heard hit the road, Jack. <laughs> Someone could definitely be leaving a situation abruptly. Some of you, like, like I said, someone could definitely be going in a whole new direction here. There's so many energy here for real. But I don't know... Who's taking a leap? Who's doing this, Pisces? You're involved. You could be dealing with the Aries for sure. You're involved. Someone could definitely want to, like I said, want to take a big leap and communicate this to you. Or again, you could have saw somebody as foolish and you could have blocked them. Somebody could be begging you to unblock them here, Pisces. <laughs> what? <laughs> Give me some more what we don't see. Pisces, you could have you listen. You could be in this energy right now, I got to be honest, where you could be definitely like, like standing your ground in a situation where you are distancing yourself and going in a different direction. Like you could be uh, silent, you can be kind of like going silent and withdrawing your energy from some chaotic shit yourself and you could be getting ready to go in a whole new direction. You could have gotten some sort of message intuitively that this is what you need to do. Give me more on this pot for Pisces for what we don't see. Well, for Pisces, for what we don't. The Ace of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles. Uh oh, Pisces. Four of Swords. There's definitely something that's being thought about. There's definitely a lot of meditation and thought behind something. If someone hasn't communicated something to you, they're trying to hold themselves back from communicating for sure. Some of you are healing from this kind of energy, but Pisces, this is what. It's bugging me the fuck out. The Nine of Pentacles, which is Beyonce. That's a single, solid, stable, abundant woman here, right? And the Ace of Cups. If you pay attention in this card, Pisces, she's pregnant in this card. And then here's the Ace of Cups. This could be something about a pregnancy, Pisces, for sure. Does not have to be Six of Wands. Some of you could definitely... Listen, if some of, if some of you have been trying to get pregnant... And you didn't think it was going to happen. You could be a mess. You could be finding out that it's going to happen here. Mm. Some of you could have found out about a pregnancy... Pregnancy does not have to be involved in particular Pisces, but I do feel like there's like some sort of, some sort of, it almost feels like giving birth because there's something, something exciting and explosive and new and wonderful that you don't see coming that is coming Pisces, like, like the birth of something completely new here. And there's the six of wands, victory and success. Yep. And there's strength. Some of you are definitely dealing with a Leo. Yes. Yes. Someone definitely wants to come, some some of you, someone definitely wants to come towards you. It's taking everything in them not to say something or express something or speak something. And they could definitely want to tell you there has something to do with a severance from this, from the mice. Put it where it goes, baby sharks. All right, let's see what our outcome is. 
Movement. You could be dealing with the cherry, uh, Cancerian, but there it goes. A change. Movement. Traveling. A trip. What else we got here? Decision. Ooh, this is judgment. Release yourself from which holds from which. Release yourself from that which holds you back. A need to detox. Unnecessary worry based on lack of self confidence. Is this the devil? Because I see detox. Mm, I'm not sure. That could be the devil. I'm just not sure. We're going to go with it, though. Let's see what else we got here. The three of swords. Oh, yeah. Someone is making a decision. I'm telling you, remove yourself. This is the, this is the sickle and the mice. Remove yourself from, which, from that which holds you back. A need to detox. Three of swords. Somebody is getting away from some, some, of the, some shit like this. The three of wands. Pisces. I told you I felt like there's a lot of people. Involved in something here with the three with the three of Raphael, the three of cups and the five of wands. I told you I felt like there's a lot of parties involved. Pisces, here it is again. Two threes. We all know what third party situations are. Like I said, all the time, oftentimes third uh, three uh third party situations does not have to be other and other lovers. A lot of the time it is. But there's definitely a lot of people involved in something here, Pisces. There's other external sources involved in something because I just feel it, right? There's movement. There's a decision to remove yourself. Someone is removing themselves. They're detoxing. They're letting go of some stress, some worries, right? They're letting go of this three of wands. Someone is manifesting a new beginning. They're getting away from this three of swords shit. They're moving away from that journey. What did I tell you? There's some, someone is getting DF away from this. They're manifesting. They're making this decision. Oh, Pisces. Well, let's see, well, let's see, well, let's see. There's a man. Masculine Pisces, you could be watching this. This could be you doing this. Feminine Pisces, this could be a man doing this towards you. Pisces, if you're a woman watching this and you're not dealing with no man, maybe you're deciding to work for yourself, right? Maybe you're deciding to be the boss and you're getting the hell away. But I for sure have a man here making a decision to move. To get away, there's two cards of traveling journey. Someone could travel for work or something like that, but there's somebody, there's a physical move. There's movement. It's moving away from this three of swords. Someone is making a decision to do that, Pisces, and there's a man involved. You could be doing this. Pisces, you could be a feminine energy. You could feel like this about a man. You could be moving on, right? This man could be coming towards you. Masculine, masculine Pisces, you could be watching this. This could be what you're doing, but I see this. There's a judgment, a decision coming in to move forward, to get past. Ooh-wee. Give me some on this outcome for the baby sharks. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and share for me. I appreciate it. Pisces, y'all the MVPs for me. I appreciate y'all the mo most. The page of swords. There's that watcher again. The five of pentacles. Somebody is figuring out. They're figuring out a master plan on how to put lead a past in a past. Five of pentacles here. Somebody could be figuring out that it's gonna, they're, they're going to lose some money. And leaving something. Pisces, some of you have a masculine energy that could be watching a woman feeling left out in the cold. He could be watching a woman move move on. He could be feeling very left out in the cold and hurt by it. For sure. Some of you had this man watching you. He wants to come, he wants to come towards you. He could be literally coming towards you from out the cold. There is a man here that's figuring something out. Some of you figured out something about a man. Could have been something about a child or about a man, and you got the hell away from him. Five of Pentacles, y'all. Yes, yep. Look, Three of Cups. I'm telling you, there's there's multiple parties involved here. Yep, Five of Swords. There's a lot of people involved in something, Pisces, and it's getting ready to come to an end. Ten of Swords. Give me some more on our outcome. Give me some more. The Three of Swords. Oh wow, wow, Pisces. Wow, Temperance. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. This is healing. There's the three of swords is here twice for the outcome. So something or someone is hurting. I feel like there's multiple parties involved in this. This is healing. Patience and divine time. And someone could definitely want to reconcile with you. Look, at look, there's that chariot movement. Something is getting ready to move forward. There's a big decision that's being made. I feel like someone has looked, studied, maybe looked at all the possibilities, looked at this all, at all angles. I have too many threes here and too much conflict. And there's a move behind this. The world, I'm telling you, for some of you guys, this is something about a literal move. This is literal movement here. Some of you do have somebody watching y'all online. They want to say something, but they, 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 I don't know why they're not saying anything yet, but they're getting ready to. Yeah, there's that King of Pentacles, the star. There's a masculine energy that's getting ready to expose something. There's a masculine energy that's getting ready. Yeah, he's getting ready to expose something. He's going to bear all or show all or something. He's been waiting to show or bear or tell something here. Put it where it goes. 
Give me one more on this outcome for Pisces. He's been waiting. There's a masculine energy. I don't know what this is going to mean for you guys. There's a masculine energy that's been waiting to bear, expose, or tell all, or something, and it's getting ready to come out. Give me some more on this outcome for Pisces. Just put it where it goes, baby sharks. The lovers. It could be a Gemini, but there it is. The Eight of Pentacles. Somebody is getting ready to um, express to a soulmate what they've been working on. Or Pisces, if if, if you if you're not dealing with a man, if you're just a feminine energy watching this, you're trying to figure out where you're divinely guided to go, what you're what to work on and put effort into because you're looking for some sort of new beginning here. You're looking to start something new. But I definitely have a masculine energy here that's getting ready to communicate something, something that he's been figuring out, working on, possibly keeping to himself or been watching or noticing. There's getting ready to be some sort of exposure. There's getting ready to be a change, a literal change, a physical change or move. Someone has made a decision here and this involves multiple parties, Pisces. You're just going to have to put yourself where you go in it. It could even be involved in a family here with the family room. I love you, baby sharks. I thank you guys for taking the time to watch my videos. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're interested in booking me for a private reading, the email information is in the description box below. You all are my MVPs. I thank you for all your support. Continue to take care of yourselves and your families, and I'll bring you messages really soon. Bye, baby sharks.